and Dill is off camera. Dill, get back here. Ow! One, go! Dill running her favorite song, Burning Town. She's, of course, very insistent on that song. So let's see how it goes. J. Crew with a speed. See how it goes. But so far, J. Crew's doing a good job keeping up. We've seen before that Steve can give Dill a pretty hard time. Why do and Zane at one point? I think there was another. Fawn, right. Fawn at one point, and uh, I think there was one other Steve main as well. Uh, D Dog, of course. I'm not sure what J. Crew's resume is, but this could be a good chance for Dill to uh, better understand the matchup and how it works. Maybe find some countermeasures. Although, all things considered, I do understand how this could be a rough. Look at, look at all these blocks! Oh my god, J. Crew's going great. Oh my god. All right, so J. Crew is a very creative player, I can see. <laughs> Look at that. He's doing a lot of fake outs, too. Is that a kill? Up throw. That's the first stock. Very nice. Mining it up. Down throw. Let's see the mash. He, J. has no mash. Interesting. And that's, in, that's information Dill's going to be able to use for the entire remainder of the set, too. If J. Crew's at like 90, Dill can just try to kill him. If he oh my! Oh! Okay, J. Crew. J. Crew's going a little hot. He truly has opened up creative mode in his Minecraft. Oh, downer doesn't work. I'm never 100% sure how, uh, how active Steve's up special is. I always see them like, the hitbox is ended, and then it has them. Might be a good time to look now while I'm uh, commentating this match. And Ideal has done a good job at evening things up. And there's the up special. Minecart. And Gil gets nailed by back air. That was a steel back air. Iron back air. There's the up tilt. These combos can be escaped sometimes with good SCI, but I feel like Rob is a special exception to this rule. Down throw? Yes. Bill knows that the down throw is going to work now. And no, it's, no DI is going to save him. Necro got the right DI, too. Very impressive. That one looks really uh, ambiguous. There he goes. He's playing Minecraft. I will also say, while Rob's uh, neutral air is good at uh, erasing lines of blocks, it does have the weakness that it does have some startup time. So it does give Steve like a moment to be like, oh, Rob is nearing my blocks. Let me do something about that. Here it is. Down throw. Down throw at 77. Still gets a follow up. If J. Crow doesn't pick up the pace on that mashing, it's going to be a real problem for him over the course of this set. There's the diamond. Oh, the classic side B down air. Got enough in the... Not enough. Oh, good use of blocks. Jesus. That's some very... That's some very bold... Uh, oh, my heart did not hit Dill. I'm surprised. Block. Oh, my God. Yeah, that'll do it. Yeah, he wants his diamond weapons. Dill's got to be careful. Any errant hit could send, send her flying. No down airs? Oh. I really appreciate how, like, creative J. Crew's been being with his blocks. You don't usually see Steve's doing that. Yeah, fair enough. Oh! Ah, block! Ah! Wow. He's got one minecart left, and that's it. He's just gonna, yeah, he's just gonna have to uh, 
He's still got his pickaxe, so pickaxe back here is still on the table here. Another minecart. Another minecart on the table. Oh, or a down air. Oh my god! Until takes game one. I didn't erase the things. I'm a bad streamer. Damn. An excellent first game, though. We'll see if these two can keep up the heat for the rest of the games. I love how janky that looked. Very funny aggression from Drake here, though. J. Crew. Boom! Flat. What an intense up game that was. And the stage being played on will be Hollow Bastion with Kingdom Hearts music. And there's Dill uh, straightening out her uh, controller. Look at the determination in these players' eyes. Such ferocity. Three, two, one, go! Ferocity. Hey, wait a minute, that's not Steve. That's Alex. Anyway, game two. Should be good. If J. Crew can keep that up, this will be very exciting to watch. Here comes the combos. Oh, uh, Dill falls out of it, I'm surprised. Mental tech, though, you couldn't really tell from that animation. <laughs> nah, there's no Reaper I punishes against Steve. Ooh. That could have been really bad for Dill, depending on how the combo went. And Gyro bounced off the block. Oh my god! That crafting table. That crafting table is legit a uh, Rivals of Ether mechanic, I swear to god. It's there, it's affecting moves. It's out there affecting moves, is integral to the player's kit, the character's kit. He's a Rivals character. Now we've got Dill sitting pretty out of full stock up right now. We'll see how it goes. There's a side special. Not enough to kill, though. And... Does a... Oh! Reads the uh, air, air dodge out, actually. Very nice. Let's see. Still looking for that steep up special uh, hit frame data. Don't assault rivals like that! up the stocks, but we'll see. Anyway, Steve's up special. Active 4. A very handsome. 17 frames. It's a lot. I actually feel it sounds about right. Damn. I got the entire Rivals cast on me. The whole Rivals like community on me for saying that. Oh, I like that. Throwing the gyro through the blocks. Dill knows the exact space. She's trying to get it through the blocks. I like that. I always try to get my uh, soccer ball through a block, uh, through a 1-3 uh, setup, but it's hard. If my ball hits the bottom block, it kind of bounces upwards. Also, when did those blocks get there? Dill kind of bounced on them. I didn't see them there either. I was just like, when did those get there? <laughs> oh my god, what a catch. Minecart. Oh, no diamonds. It actually takes longer to craft diamonds, for those of you who didn't know. Diamonds. No reason not to have it right now. Oh, is that it? No, not yet. But no minecarts. <laughs> Very good recovery angle. Something to keep in mind. Um, Hollow Bastion is a steel stage, actually. Eve mines more slowly on this stage, and... As you're noticing, more steals, less materials overall. And 
you always see this come into play at the end of games on this stage, or like Pokemon Stadium 2, where Steve just is forced to bleed into their own uh, seal resources. Down throw? Not yet. Still doesn't want to do it at 67. Back air. That's a diamond back air. Dylan, last stock. Let's see how it goes. Oh my god. I'm surprised Dylan didn't go for uh, down tilts there. Down tilts against the wall. That's always fun. Down air. I'm not sure it's worth it to go for down chases like that. Not against Rob, who can just be like, I'll go as low as I want. Minecart. Didn't get killed by the gyro. I'm surprised. And J Crew is trying to avoid. Uh oh, uh oh. Let's see it. Up air. Correct the eye. But look at this. He's all out of everything. Yeah, there's nothing he could have done about that. And Dill takes the set. Very nice from Dill. And overall, a very excellent set, to be sure. Let's see those kills. To uh, this Power Rangers music. And there we go, J. Crew getting killed by that Rivals of Ether mechanic, of course. And we got Devin in the back slowing down the replay so we can really appreciate the... Uh, I messed up on my timing. <laughs> Well, I guess as long as Devin's doing it. This back air is so strong. Diamond back air is so powerful. Kaboom! Anyway, a great set from the two. It should be... It was most excellent. 